divide the beads. For these problems, we are going to be dividing beads. To do that, we'll put one here and then one here, and then we'll be dividing them. And so you can see what it equals to. So for the first one, we'll start off easy. We just have here the number two. To divide the number two, we'd put one bead here and one bead here. So one and one. One plus one equals two. Okay, so now we have the number eight. Let's divide the number eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. In both of these boxes, we have one, two, three, four. Four beads. So four plus four equals eight. Now we see the number 16. So let's divide this number with beads. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So how many beads are in each of these boxes? Well, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight beads in each of these boxes here. So eight plus eight is 16. So we divided the number into two. All right, now we have the number 20. Nice big number. So let's split up this number. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. So how many beads are in each of these boxes here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten beads in each of these boxes. So we divided it into two. So ten plus ten equals twenty. Great work, and good luck solving your next math problems.